Hello everyone, the Dex here, welcome to episode number 9 of Season 2 Let's Play. Uh, in the last episode I was planning on starting to get uh, power from this giant oil fountain over here uh, for my quarry. So I was growing cacti and I got myself about a stack and a half that right now I'm cooking right here to get into cactus green and let it transform into waterproofing. And I built this nice room with the green zycorium flooring. Because this room I plan to be where I'm gonna store and uh, refine oil and fuel. So actually in the previous episode I was building tanks, but I decided I don't want tanks. Um, I simply would prefer to get some well craft tanks, these type of tanks. I want wall tanks, and for those I'm gonna need a rolling machine. So let's get one. It's gonna be useful anyway, eventually. So I'm gonna need four pistons, a crafting table, and four iron ingots. Let's see, I already have one crafting table. Oh, I already have some on me anyway. Uh, a piston. Should be making a bunch anyway. I'll just make one for now. I'm gonna need some wood as well, cobblestone. So one, two, three, those cobblestone, this. So I got myself the piston. Oh wait, how many pistons do I need? Oh, I need four pistons. Whoops. All right, so. We're really looking forward for the 1.5 update that will add uh, inventory management options that are going to be very very useful which will allow you to very fast manage uh, crafting crafting grids and everything and they're going to be very very awesome can't wait for this and of course the redstone update which to be honest quite a little bit scares me because i don't know what's going to change and what's going to break but uh yeah all right so i got myself the rolling machine and for a tank there is an iron wall, and there is a gauge, and there is... Anyway, I'm going to need a lot of iron plates, so I'm going to need a lot of iron. Let's see. Let's try doing with a stack. Stack will give me... Oh, it needs power. Alright, so let's move it right over here. as if I was planning to use it right here. All right, so it's also automatic, so it's nice. Let's take a good night's sleep, so no monsters surprise me. So right now I'm planning just on pumping the oil and storing it and using it uh, as an oil and not as fuel, uh, just to get my quarry going. Uh, and I think all those cactus green should be enough waterproofing, pretty sure, yeah. So, just need to do it like so. Let's keep uh, this stack as is. And with waterproofing, I'm going to create... Uh, let's see. Let's have... Uh, I think two pipes I think will be fine. And I'm going to need a lot of stone pipes. I'm not going to use gold because I don't have too much gold right now. So there is stone and there is cobblestone. Yeah, let's create the stone ones. So, 16 stone I think should be good, and I want a little bit more glass, so 64 of those, and so two wooden pipes turn into waterproof ones, and 62 of those, yeah, seems good. Alright, so I've got already 33. Yeah, there's definitely more than I need. So for a tank, I'm gonna go for the basic one, which is which is three by four by three. So let's see. How many of those am I going to need? By the way, what can I create with this? Low pressure boiler? Okay. Alright. So I'm gonna need, let's see, nine on the base, another nine on the top. She's 18, and two more, I'm going to need 26, I 
think. 2, 3, 4, 20. All right, we're going to have some spare. So let's have it exactly in the corner, or let's move it. No, let's have it in the corner. We can move it in the worst case. All right. And for the sides, I'm going to use the glass ones. So I'm going to glass panes. So six glasses for pane. Where did I store all my glass? All right. So 16 panes. Oops. All right, so I think four would be, and I'm going to need eight. Yeah. So let's place them down like so, one here, one here, one here, one here. And I think from this side here I'm going to have Evolve and... Yeah, I think so, on this side and this side, no Evolves. Oops. The middle can be empty. Alright, and for Evolve... I'm going to need iron plates, I need four more. Yeah, I'm going to need... Oh, I'm still rolling there, so it should be fine. Right. <coughs> so I'm going to need iron bars, so six iron ingots. And the lever as well. Oh, whoops, not this. There we go. Four arm valves. You know what? Let me uh, place a valve on each one of those exits. Just in case. It doesn't hurt me. I already have those spare valves anyway. So one here, one here, one here, and one here. It should update. Yep, got an iron tank. And this tank can uh, hold... Uh, 16 buckets times the amount of blocks that it has. So that's 16 times 3 times 3 times 4. So it's basically equivalent to if I'm going to have all this space uh, used by tanks, the normal Bircroft tanks, it would hold exactly the same amount of fuel. But this way, I think it looks a little bit nicer. So I'm going to have it like this. So let's place down a chest in this room for everything pipes and tanks and everything related. Alright, so let's get our pump done. So we need the pipes, coal, let's have uh, levers just in case and I think it should be fine. So let's quickly carve the exit. Now, there are no teleport pipes at the moment in this mod pack, so I don't have any diamonds anyway, but there is no teleport pipe, so it's going to have to be a little bit ugly. I hope 60 will be enough right now. Right, so I'm going to need to find the source block. This uh, may be a little bit harder than you might think. need to find where it goes down into the ground. Hopefully not, not too far away. Oh, it's up there. Uh, let's take a quick shortcut. All right, and it's probably somewhere in maybe this block. Need somewhere that I can go down. Nope. Uh, what? Maybe here? Maybe over here? 
Nope, what? Uh huh, so there is. Is it just a small tiny pool and it's causing all of this? Alright, let's just give it a try, see what's happening. Let's place uh, the pump right here. I hope that's a bigger pool than I think it might be right now. Because I'm getting a little bit scared. It might be smaller than I thought and not worth all the trouble. Alright, so redstone engines. One, two, three, and four. Let's keep that. That's on. And that's on. And now for the pipes. Alright, so how am I going to do this? Uh. Yeah. I hope I'm not destroying any source blocks in that process. Alright, let's do it a little bit smarter. Let's do it from up here. And then go down or basically build from bottom up instead I have a feeling 60 is not going to be enough right, need to get a little bit further and I think I can jump from here Yeah, I'm going to need more pipes. Yeah, I'm going to get some more beer back. Alright, so just got some more pipes and I noticed that this, this thing is disappearing. So I have a feeling that that oil well was a lot smaller than I thought it was. And I hope that wasn't too much of a mistake to do all of this here. Either way, I'm going to have to find a different source of power until I find some more oil. So I think I may go for another hobbyist steam engine but let's at least salvage whatever i managed to get from here so i think right here start building up whoop all right something changed i mean i can build through myself it seems yeah it's a little bit weird i'm gonna have to fall i think and die Alright, or do this. I think I have I heard an explosion in the background. I hope I didn't. Alright, so twenty six pipes, yeah, they won't make it. And I ran out of cacti. Not good. Not even the slightest. Alright, let's see if I hope nothing exploded here, nothing too important. Yeah, okay, something happened here. Okay, this pipe exploded. I think because I'm not using any energy, uh, the pipes are going mad. So let's actually do something. Let's cook some sand. And I actually lost the pipe here. I don't like it. Let's cook some sand. And get a new pipe in here. So, the energy just seems just, yeah, okay. So there is apparently some huge buildup in them, in the engines, and if there is no way for it to go, it simply explodes. How much oil do these pipes have? 
just a tiny bit. Oh, there is still a little more from up there. Let's see how's the pipe doing up there. Yep, it's not connected to anything. That was a very, very tiny pool. Maybe I'm being too optimistic, thinking that maybe it was some kind of a bug and there is actually a pool here somewhere hidden behind the ground. Under the ground, that is. Because it feels like too much of a bad dream. Never seen th something like this. Well, I'm gonna have to find a different solution anyway. But let's at, at least harvest some of the oil here. It's ever available. Need, okay, I'm gonna harvest all those cacti and bear it back. Alright, so I got myself 48 more pipes. I'm pretty sure that will be enough. So this time I'm gonna go from this side instead to make sure that I right, need to get to this block row. I don't know if it's intended or not that I can blick up I can build upon myself. I can place blocks. Just like came through me, so it's quite weird. Alright, so at least I'm gonna store some oil. And I can pretty much break down the the pump. It's, it doesn't have any use there anymore. However, the day is coming down, so I'm gonna go have a quick nap. Well, at least uh, it wasn't a complete waste because I did gather some oil, and it will be handy eventually. Uh, but feels a little bit like a waste of time, to be honest. Uh, I don't know. It it wasn't it probably wasn't worth all the effort here when I was so certain that there would be so much more in here. This is the little bit uh, disappointing part. When you expect more, you get nothing. And now I need to climb up, which seems to be possible. Right, so I'm gonna go back uh, up there, tear down the pump, and be right back. Alright, so let's see how much did I manage to collect. Uh, almost eight buckets, okay. I think I can call it officially uh, a waste of time. Alright, so I think, yeah, I managed to get this pipe to explode again. And these two are running out of water. And it's actually quite bad if they run out of water, so let's try to avoid that. It's not the case yet, but just uh, rather not even get there. And let's place another pipe. And not turn it on because I think already that's the fourth pipe that I'm placing here, or the third. So. So, let's finally place down... Alright, so actually, you know what? I'm gonna break one of those engines. And use them for my uh, quarry. So let's get all the materials for the quarry. I need the quarry itself. And... You know what? I'm gonna use the redstone engines for just a little bit more power. So I'm going to need uh, a wooden conductive pipe. And can use, or to use the golden conductive pipes here. Let's create an, another set of those. They're very useful. Uh, handling the liquids doesn't matter that much, but at least with the power, I rather not lose anything. Because if I'm not mistaken, uh, with the liquids you don't lose anything; it just goes slower. But with the power, you actually you actually lose. You actually lose efficiency. So I rather avoid that. Alright, so I must have the wooden conductive pipe, the coal, the golden conductive pipes, the redstone engines, the new this engine, some torches, some levers, the quarry, just let's get the chest. And I think I'll be good. Again, I know for now uh, there is no sorting system. I'm gonna use it manually, I'm just gonna handle everything manually. 
uh, and also want to build a storage system eventually with barrels and everything. So this is all very very temporary but very useful. And some buckets and I think I'm ready. Oh, I just, I, I'm going to require a chest obviously. Let's get a double chest. So it will last longer. And I'm pretty sure I'm good. can seal this off. Okay, I don't have any materials on me. Alright, so I'm gonna build it right here in the close to very close to the ocean. Let's build a small platform outside. Uh, like this. Let's face it towards there. Oh wait, that's the pump need the quarry, not the pump. Alright. Oh, it will also keep uh, chunks loaded automatically. Nice. So if I, tr if I travel away from here, obviously when I'm not a flying it won't work, but if, when I travel away from here it will work. So that's nice. Alright, so two chests. And I can actually use the pump, if I already have it here, to fuel the hobbyist steam engine. Yeah, why not? So when I have this um, here, I'm gonna require. I just got one wooden conductive pipe. Not the best idea. All right. So let's have. Yeah, I'm gonna need some more of those pipes. Spare back. And how about a door from here to make it look a little bit nicer? And some sort of a stairway. So it will be a little bit nicer. That's ugly. Okay, I'm gonna fix it eventually. So, wooden conductive pipes. Um, I want my pump to directly receive power and also feed water into um, the steam engine. So let's have the pump right here. Or you know what, no, let's, I'm gonna have a separate, one of the redstone engines to be dedicated for this, it will be easier to manage. So I can actually get rid of this pipe. And have just one wooden pipe here. And except for one, let's have the hobbyist engine here. And run the redstone engine here. And here. And here. Because why not? You know, I need some way to power them, of course. So let's close down this small area. So I can break this block. Oh, this is going to take a while. It reminds me of <laughs> the a little bit when you fight for every possible small area of space. All right, so a torch. All right, these two are operating. And another one here. Where I'm gonna have coal here, and let's have let's give it a small boost of water to begin with, and we can turn it on. All right, sitting up. I don't know why these t these three are not working. Hopefully they're fine. And right here, very simple. I can even use the same torch. 
that will feed water into this, hopefully. It should. I want to see it happening. All right, so the pump refuses to feed it into water. It should uh, recognize it as an inventory. I don't know why it doesn't. Let's just give it a small boost and just use pipes nearby. I don't, I don't know why it doesn't work. It should work without any problem. It's very weird. This would work though. I hope so. You know what? Actually, it doesn't have any water yet, so maybe that's the problem. Maybe one redstone engine works really, really slow. Oh, I'm giving it, I'm gonna give it a little bit more time. See how it does over a longer period. And these engines are not doing anything yet as well. The torch is still here, right? It didn't die or anything, yeah. Maybe in order to operate the quarry, they need to be more heated up. I don't know. Alright, we're just going to leave it here for now. Alright, so I finally started digging. Um, the pump here still doesn't do anything. Those engines turned green and they're still doing anything. It doesn't do, they don't do anything yet as well. Uh, yeah, they should start working as far as I know. I don't know why, why they don't they. But yeah, still I'm starting to get, to get stuff. So this is good. And I got this to be a little bit prettier. Can't even hide all of this uh, nonsense. Yeah. So you got this nice staircase and everything. All right, so now that I have some passive resource generation, I can finally allow myself to get back to some research because even though while supposedly I'm not doing anything while I'm uh, researching, at least now I'm generating a little bit of uh, resources while doing stuff. So, I'm gonna finish this Cognito one. Okay, just got the one book. And now I need the, the Flux and Chaos. I have a feeling that what I need for those two is this. It's either Nitor or, or Alumentium. I have a feeling that Nitor is the one I need because of, I don't know, it has this uh, fire element to it. And this one requires uh, Chaos. I have a feeling that's the one I need. Or maybe gunpowder? I didn't actually try gunpowder. Or TNT. Let's see, gunpowder, no, fire. What has a chaos element to it? Chaos, no, blaze powder, no. No. All right, so I'm just gonna do one of those uh, Night or ones. So I need Ignis, Lux, and Potentia. Lux is very simple with torches. Uh, Ignis, Ignis and Potentia. I think that's redstone. No. That's Ignis. Yeah, I think that's exactly what I need. So this is two and two, and this is one. So I need six torches and two co and two coal. Let's get uh, some sort of water source in here for faster access. A little bit ugly, but I need water. I don't really care if it will be in the middle of the room. Just want to have some available water nearby. That will be a bad idea. Quite bad. Let's have it here. Oh, green water. Okay. So, uh, fill it up. And so, two coal and six torches. One, two. And one, two, three, four, five, six. Wand and magic. Nice. Night or no, it doesn't have chaos. Okay. Then maybe elementum. 
Let's try element to minute fractus, ignis and potentia. Fractus is cobble. And yeah, and coal. I need some more cobble and some more coal. Be right back. Okay, so let's see. I need uh three fractus and six and six. So that's three of those and three of each basically. So oh, I need water. So one, two, three. Wait, does it has to boil first? Okay, one, two, three, and one, two, three. Okay. Nope. Nothing as well. Okay, so what has a chaos element to it? Maybe something in the nether. For that I need diamonds, because I need to mine uh, obsidian. How much gold do I have? Can I afford getting a drill? A diamond drill. I need three diamonds for this. I have 22 gold and... You know what? Let's get a drill. I want to get into the nether anyway already. So three diamonds. And for the drill itself, that actually I don't have yet, uh, should be a good idea to finally build one. Let's see. Drill. Advanced one. Oh, seems fun, but I don't have uh, resources for this yet. So, five refined iron, electric circuit, and an RE battery. Five refined iron. And... I need another one for the circuit. I need some tin, mainly for the RE battery, so four. Some redstone I have, some rubber, some copper. I think it should be good. Let's see, let's get... Uh oh, this is bronze. I hate having all those different types of colors, it drives me crazy. Alright, so I got the chip. And I'm gonna need I have exactly one cable available here to make it into a battery. And what was the order? This is down here, this is up top, and refined iron. And now with the diamonds, the diamond drill, awesome. Some diamond mining power, let's charge it up. Oh, fairly fast. How is our quarry doing? Okay, so it's finally, yeah, getting power. Can I, whoa, I'm getting great engines. What the hell? Where is my pick? Okay, so I guess redstone engines are not meant for this. Can I get rid of this and will it still work? Yeah, it's staying full. Nice, so it does work the way I expected it to. Uh, aluminum, sand and crap mainly. Can process some sand into glass. In the meantime. And why don't I have something here? It shouldn't work because I don't want it to explode. Just waste some of this power. Alright, so I'm gonna go back down and get some more obsidian. Be right back. Alright, so back to this same wretched cave that uh, made me lose my diamonds. Uh, so I'm gonna get my obsidian here. Actually, I'm noticing that the length of the video is getting quite long. So I'm just gonna get some obsidian. I actually wanna give it a try to see if this one has the chaos element that I need for my research. Nope, it has something else to get altogether, but no chaos element. So I'm gonna mine some obsidian and probably do some other minor stuff and see you guys in the next episode.